Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Vitamin Y. So, this deck got a tiny little change. So, of course, you guys have been... Uh, well, you guys know that when it came to this deck, I was trying to just figure out what that last card should be. It's been... It was 39 cards, and I just couldn't figure out what that last card, that fourth card should be. I tried to learn Darkness, I didn't like it. I tried, um, you know, Burl, didn't really pull that off that well. So, so of course, as you guys know, I've been trying out the whole uh, new um, running... Um, uh, nefarious Archfiend of Nefariousness, and that, and you know, I decided to go ahead, that f last card, why not it be Nefarious Archfiend of Nefariousness, this, 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 this. So, uh, we're gonna go ahead and try him out, which of course, Nefarious Archfiend of Nefariousness is not a terrible card, to tell you the truth. Um, yeah, so where is he, where is he, he's out here at the bottom. The only problem is he's Earth, if he was Dark, he would definitely, definitely, definitely be with us all the time. But because he is not, and he is Earth, I'm having a really hard time trying to do plays with him, so. Yeah. I'm thinking maybe you will make a little wall chain? No? No? Let's try, let's try Nefarious Archfiend and Nefariousness. Let's just go ahead and put him in the graveyard right now and see how good he can be. Alright? So we got Mask Chameleon. Mask Chameleon can, of course, summon you Bell, and if my opponent doesn't want to uh, kill you Bell, you know, during the phase, I can just spell me back Archfiend, destroy you Bell, and summon Terror, you know? And then Terror can destroy Terror, I mean, and then Nefarious Archfiend can, you know, destroy Terror and summon Ultimate Nightmare. So, you know, once Archfiend gets no good, I, I pretty much have manipulation during my opponent's end phase of which one of you Bell I want. So it's not completely terrible. So we'll go ahead and just try that out. Alright. Let's say you want to take your turn, sir. So, wasn't the best of plays. I kind of used the whole drawing terror thing to my advantage with Dark Greffer, but, you know, I super negged myself, so. My opponent can easily, easily defeat me just by simply just one-upping me with a back row. You know? It's one of the flaws of running Yubel deck and running, just playing Yu-Gi-Oh! in general, is that Yu-Gi-Oh! is a game of resource, and, you know, if you run out of resources, it's game over, you know. So if you're running decks that, you know, generate generate resources over and over and over again you know you'll do fine in life oh injection fairy lily all right so i guess he wants to pay two thousand life points to increase his attack by three thousand i haven't seen that bitch in a while what's this say okay so pretty much you're gonna attack me directly with three thousand four hundred points of damage Ouch. Well, that hurts. The upside is, is that I get to keep my little level chain. So, that's the upside. The downside is I'm going to be taking 3,400 damage to my fucking face. Never mind. I'm going to be taking 4,200 damage to my fucking face. Over half my life points in one fucking attack. Gonna use your effect. Pay two thousand. Yup, two thousand. There goes a huge chunk out of my fucking life points. <laughs> like injection fairly, do four thousand two hundred without using your effect, like. Injection fairly at 4,200 without her effect? That's some crazy shit. Like, something must have happened. Like, you must have had, like, a whole bunch of United We Stands and shit like that. Because that is some cray cray shit. <laughs> Alright, so. you All pendulum monsters gain 300 attack. That's your pendulum effect? Yeah. Alright. I'm fine with that. Wow! Fantastic, baby! I think I might game him right now. He should have killed my Lavalo Chain effect. Uh, he should have killed my Lavalo Chain. I think I got this right now. Right fucking now. That top deck of that fucking Plague Spreader. That top deck of that fucking Plague Spreader is about to fucking just... Oh my god, yes. <laughs> Thank you, Plague Spreader. Wow. I heard you like Limited Reverse. <laughs> Eight. You know, I totally don't mind 
putting a um, uh, playing, I mean, a mass chameleon on top of the deck because I told, oh, no, 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 Mally Fact, actually, Mally Fact, actually. I don't want to shuffle the, 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 um, the mass chameleon. I don't mind drawing it. So. Like I said, I think this might be game, but now Plague. I almost fucked that up. You get banished, you go to the grave. Go ahead and go into Scrappity Scrap Scrap. Scrap the fat target feels. Is it B E E L Z E or B E E? Yeah, L Z E. And uh, Lily. I'll just say Lily. I don't want to say injection. I don't want to say fairy. I'll just say Lily. So, free pop, attack, attack, attack this game. Free pop, free pop. It's like free cake, except better. No. I don't want. Well, well, to me it is, because I don't like cake. I don't. Cool. Fact for. You guys, now, make if I ever get so big that you guys are gonna make like a game called, you know, You Will Master Trivia. That could be on there. Does You Will Master like cake? No, I don't like cake at all. Like, so much, I don't like cake so much that on my birthday, I do not get a cake. Sometimes I get a pie. Sometimes I get a cookie, a big cookie. Sometimes, most of the time, I get banana pudding. Like, oh my god, like, banana pudding is my shit. Like, oh my god. Like, ladies out there, you want to get to a man's heart? Make me some banana pudding. <laughs> Roxas Keyblade. Mm. And he speaks Spanish. How dare you. <laughs> Alright. Let's get another duel. That was, that was chill. That top deck plague literally won me that duel. The top deck plague plus the fact that, uh... Um, that he didn't kill my bubble chain, which was totally his fault. Wow. Open stupid again. And by stupid, I mean awesome. <laughs> like I said, I'm not sure what to do with the whole nefarious archie and the nefariousness. Is, I want it to be in there. I want it to do its job. But it being not dark is really hurting its chances of doing anything useful for me. So... That's getting a little bit upsetting. Go ahead. I'll take the damage on the chin. I don't know what language that is. I think that's Spanish. Like, Please don't try to speak Spanish to me because I don't speak the Spanish. Oh, Harpy Queen. Oh, my God. So, Harpy Ladies. Oh, there goes all my back row. There goes all my call time. I hate that. I hate that when you set back row and it's Harpy Ladies. I'm just like, ah! Like, I wouldn't have set it if I know it was Harpies. Yeah. Yep. I wanna cry. I don't I know I don't know what this means, but I know what's going on, alright? <laughs> that really makes me sad. Yep. I mean, I could revive, but it wouldn't matter. It'd still just die, so. Yep, so you're 15, 18, 18. I could do math. And you're 17. Please don't tell me you're going to summon Harpy Dancer again and pop your own sign. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. Sure. No effect. You fucked up. <laughs> Christmas. Wow. 
You fucked up. If you're a real harpy player, you would know that it doesn't work like that. You can only activate one of the signs of Hysteric Sign only once per turn and only once that turn. You already activated the effect of Search for Elegant Egotist, therefore, your end phase pop effect. So, exact. No. You only get one of its effects per turn. Oh my god. You know what? Not even gonna try to explain it to you. Not even gonna try to explain it to you. Because you're clearly speaking in Spanish, and I can't speak in Spanish to even help you. But keep on going around trying to be bad with Harpy Ladies in Spanish and see how far that gets you. I don't want to be racist or anything, but I really think there should be a separate dueling network for people who speak Spanish. Alright? I'm not going to fucking sit here and try to whip out a translator and try to fucking translate shit. Wow. Oh. <sighs> Have like a Armageddon Knight or Dark Griff or something, we'd be okay. It's another synchro deck. Oh, toes tired of synchro decks. No, I, I'm not gonna do a synchro deck. Ah, I'm so tired of doing synchro decks. I do this shit like every day, every damn day. I wouldn't do this every single day. Every single day. What's up with people in synchro decks? Alright, so special summoning Doppel Warrior. Guess he's synchroing. Tuning effect. This card can be treated as a level two, so uh, he's thinking for four. Oh no, tuning where is not the tuner. I always thought tuning where is a tuner. Uh, no jet. Yeah. Once again, the same thing with fucking <laughs> Hysteric Sign. You can only use one Jet Synchro effect per turn only once that turn. You gotta use its whole Summon from Grave effect. And it was also, it wasn't sent to the Grave. Also, it was not sent to Grave as a Synchro material. No, it's discarded since a grave sick material, but when it leaves the field and summoning from its own effect. Uh, it's 24 and then 800 for the tokens. Phantom of Chaos, alright, that's not what I need at all. At all, that's not what I need. No way. Alright, everybody and their mother is using this deck right now. So you will learn it. Everybody and their mother. Actually, you know what? You say so? I don't think so. It gets really boring to me. Seeing the same plays. All the time, I face this deck. I'm facing this deck more than fucking Light Swarms. Everybody and their mother's fucking using it.
Mm-hmm. What's my next card? Mally? Alright, you got it. We'll get one more Dolan. Clearly, I was not drawing well on that one. From Triple Road to Triple Arm again, then Triple Dark Reference. Nowhere to be found. Nowhere to be found. Yeah, I would like to get my senders on. My senders are very vital to this deck. Very vital, so. Yeah. If I had Dark Greffer, I'd be happy. Armageddon, I'd be happy. Rhoda would be happy, you know? This is fine. Well, let's see if I can bait him out. I'm gonna drop you, Bell. Oh, I was gonna draw Nefarious Archery and Nefariousness. Like I said, I really want to utilize that card, but... It, no, running multiple copies. I mean, what's the point? You know, I'm trying to figure it out. You know, I think Akashi or Kyle runs two. You know, but I might do something. At least it's level four. All right, this should be the last duel. So whatever we're facing, hopefully not something sacky. Hopefully we can get a good duel in. Sure. So did you upstart into an upstart, or did you just want to do separate effects like that? Oh, okay. That was kind of anticlimactic, but sure, we'll go with that. I can go into Levolvo Chain and then send in Nefarious Arch Chain, then I have Oasis to go ahead and pop. Yeah, seems like a pretty good plan. Normal Summon. Okay. Go ahead and attack. Dark Worlds. Alright. Well, that should be fun. Let's go into the wobble chain. Okay. Like, what the fuck do you have? Why would you set snow? I guess you have your field spell. I don't know. I don't know. I don't like Dark World. Yeah, you know, Dark World Bell got kicked off of here a long, 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 long time ago. So, all right, go ahead. I said, I'm trying to figure out what you're doing. I think you have your field spell. You just didn't want to play it yet because you didn't have a fiend in the graveyard. Now, since you got a fiend in the graveyard with snow, I can go ahead and do that. Well, I guess I should thank you so I don't draw Ultimate Nightmare. Graph, Grafla? Yep. Grafla Fett? Sure. I'm going to uh, chain. Spots? I guess I should thank you, so I don't have to just draw an ultimate nightmare and do nothing with it. Okay. Gonna summon the bell. Graffle will go off. Pop me. And I will get my effect. Also, that is resolved. Because this happens after the chain. So I don't miss. I know I missed yesterday. I realized that. I was actually kind of thinking it when I was like editing the video. I'm like, wait, do I miss Tommy? Oh, well, I don't care. If that guy can cheat, then why can't I? Like, shit. That's what I say for a lot of these people on fucking DM. Like, if they can cheat, why can't I? Banish. Discard. Draw. Brow effect. Draw. Ugh, Dark Worlds. Alright. Go ahead and discard. You go first. Yep, alright. I hate Dark Worlds. I hate I hate Grapha, I hate this card, I hate Scale Drain, I hate I hate Dark Worlds. They're annoying. Pick whoever you want, I'm gonna shut. On Soul Charge, Tech Soul Charge, sure. Said, I don't like this deck. Like, get the fuck out of my hand with your fucking annoyingness. John Mally, alright. Mm. 
you know, thanks to the sealed spell, Yvel actually has attack, so. Uh, do I want to? Yeah. Fuck it. Turning an ultimate nightmare might be the most beneficial play I can do in this situation. Yep, mine crushed too. Calling. Calling. Okay. Calling. What you calling? If you call soul charge, then I don't have to show you my hand. Okay. I don't have to show you my hand because the card is at one. Uh, I should probably get rid of my hand. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Like I said, Dark Worlds are annoying. They're like the embodiment of annoying. Sure. Calling. Okay. Calling. <sighs> so annoying. I kind of thought he was going to have another one, but fuck it. Shouldn't let it, shouldn't allow me to hinder my plays. All right. Now I got to show my hand. Go ahead. It's fucking annoying. You know what? I should have attributed and said it to Mally. I should have done that. Totally should have done that. Mm hmm. Totally should have done that. I should have attributed and said to Mally. I don't have no cards in my hand. And all that greatness. Skarm XC into their mains, right? Alucard. I'll chain. I said dark worlds are annoying. Mm-hmm. Sure, you can come on nefariousness. Mm-hmm. God, Dark Worlds are annoying. It's been a cool minute since I faced them. But God, they're annoying. Hmm. What do I want to do right now? What am I gonna do with you, Bell? Should I just let it kill itself? Could let it kill Ultimate Nightmare and something tear. I might do that. Oh my god, alright, you got it. 
You got it. Dark worlds are annoying. Still annoying. Told you. Mine, uh, that, that, right there. That's why dark worlds are annoying. They're still annoying. Like, skill drain is such an annoying card. And it's still like three. It's stupid. All right, I'm going to go ahead and call up. So, so, glad I got to end the video with that deck. It's fun. I remember how much I hate that deck. <laughs> All right, I'm going to call up. So, so, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see uh, you guys tomorrow with uh, with Uboxes. Actually, Uboxes won. So, uh, you know, I guess since the Bones Actors will be getting taken off this Saturday. So, Uboxes, I changed the deck around a little bit. So, we're going to go ahead and see how that works. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. See you guys tomorrow.